Hi, welcome to Shimmer Simply. I'm recreating a look from Instagram down below. And please subscribe, please like the video, and ring the bell. Keep watching to see how I got this look. Starting off, I am going to prime my eyes with Studio Sculpt Concealer by MAC, it's NC20. And I just use my fingers to put it all over my eyes. Using the NYX Finishing Powder in the shade Banana Tarte Brush, going to set my eyes with a powder. Next, I'm going to use a Makeup Geek shade in Potential, that's the name of the shade, and using Jaclyn Hill JH32 brush to using windshield wiper motions to get that on my crease and a little bit towards my eyebrow. And I just keep blending, blending, blending. Using the Jaclyn Hill palette, the shade is Silk Cream. I'm going to use that um, and I'm using, I believe this is the JH33 brush to put that color a little bit more precisely in my crease. Taking that first brush that I used for eyeshadow and just blending everything together. Next, I'm going to use the shade Creamsicle and I'm using the same brush, putting this also precisely into my crease. Using the Makeup Geek Pumpkin Spice Palette, you can't really see what color I'm using, but it is the Cocoa Bear color. I'm using that more precisely in my crease. I also have a look, I will link the video down below with this palette itself. And next I'm using the Cherry Cola color. I'm going to put that on the outer corner and the inner corner of my eyes. Then using a fluffier brush, I'm going to just blend everything together. Using my finger, I'm going to put some concealer at the inner part of my eyes and then I'm using Makeup Geek. Again, it is the color Fortune Teller. It's a gold color. Again, blending everything together, blend, blend, blend. Here I go, I keep blending. I'm going to put a little bit more Fortune Teller on top. Then I just keep blending again some more and going to put in the inner corner of my eyes it's Makeup Geek Shimmer Shimmer. I'm also putting it under my eyebrows. And we got some more blending, a little bit of wine for the evening. Fit Me Concealer. It is in the shade 220. It's Maybelline. I do love this concealer. I do feel like I need to find a different shade, but I'm not sure which one now. But I really love this concealer. It's great for the summer. And they have a great shade range. I use, um, this is a... Real Techniques Buffing blush Brush. It is my favorite brush for liquid concealer. And then I also use a beauty sponge to help make things even. Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Mine is in the shade 22B, which is a light beige. And my favorite concealer brush, which is from Sigma, it is the Soft Blend Concealer Brush, which is an F64. This brush is so great. I was recommended by Allie Glines, by her favorite makeup brush, and I will link that video down below. I then use the Beauty Blender just to blend in the concealer a little bit more. Next, using Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in Light Medium Shade 20, and I'm using a BH Cosmetics brush. This is brush number two in a set that I'll link below. Using, um, just as you saw, the Milani um, Glow in four bronzer, and using in that same set a BH Cosmetics one brush. And that brush set is awesome. I will link that down below. I'm going to be using NARS Blush in Orgasm, and I'm using a Tarte brush that came in a set. And just putting that on the apples of my cheeks. Using an Echo Tools fan brush and Estee Lauder Dual Finish Highlighter in Radiance Rose Gold and Benefit Cosmetics for my brows. This is the um, Gimme Brow. I use 4.5. I also use their very thin Precisely My Brow Pencil in 4.5. I absolutely love this for eyebrows. It's thin, 
it's soft you're able to fill in you're able to line um, the gimme brow is also awesome i highly recommend both next i will use the goof proof brow pencil in 4.5 also and i use that to fill in the brows a little bit as well using a thin eyeliner brush and cherry cola from the makeup geek cosmetics i'm going to line the top of my eyes and the bottom of my eyes just very lightly and then i'm going to take a spoolie and kind of flick off any excess powder that i got on places i didn't want here you will see me use my eyelash curler it's Yumera. and then for mascara today i'm using the voluminous lash paradise from l'oreal this is actually a waterproof version i love this mascara i went to get it in regular um but they didn't have it so i got the waterproof and i actually don't mind it it's easy to get off and it's just my favorite mascara especially from a drugstore so I'm using Gerard Cosmetics Lip Liner, and this is terrible, but I cannot remember for the life of me which one I used. But I do have a video, I will link it below, of a bunch of Gerard Cosmetics lip products, and you can see the different shades. And then I'm going to use a Gerard Cosmetics um, Hydra Matte Lip as well. I love these lips. So this is the look. I hope that you like it. I then added a little bit of the max fix spray just to hold it in and i just wave my hand around and here is the look this is a great night out look that you can wear in the winter or the summer thanks for watching